Today's hottest music, Hot 103, Jackie, Joey, Big Show. We're here with our good friend, Nicole, from Home Builders Association. Right, Joey? That's right. <laughs> What's up, Nicole? Long time no talk. What's up? Hey, get to see my favorite peeps. <laughs> oh, we're so excited to see you. <laughs> How have things been going, Nicole? How's it been? We haven't talked to you, it seems like, in almost two months. Uh, what was the yes. last event that had to cancel before everything happened and uh how have things been going let me start off by how are you nicole how are things been going look there's the dog um things are going great um i told you he vomited at least once or twice um things are going great they they went great even during quarantine we worked from home for two months um we kept the association alive and going just from home we are back in the office now uh, by appointment only um, we did have to postpone our home and garden show. That was very, very hard. Um, Showcase of Homes, we are doing virtual right now. So we're actually out every day. We go and visit a builder and we, we look at their homes and oh my gosh, they're so beautiful. Can't wait so, till November. With the virtual um, ones, you can just log onto your computer and check out the homes from your computer? Yes, so our Facebook page, we're just going out and either doing a Facebook Live or an actual video. And we are just talking to the builder and they're showing us their home. How cool. That's and awesome. we do have a new website for our showcase. So showcaselascruces.com um, actually has all of the homes that were supposed to be in the, the spring showcase of homes. And, we'll and now that, we'll be in the fall. Perfect. We'll put that in the comments like uh, below that way anyone can check that okay, out. Okay, awesome. Well. Thank you. You know, and one of the things that, and Jackie knows, uh, every year I always look forward to the showcase of <laughs> homes. I was, it was one of those things that I've always just loved to go and check out. Uh, whenever it was happening on the weekends, the wife and I would go and check out the homes, the builders. It was just such an interactive way to, you know, get to know uh, some of the businesses here in Las Cruces, some of the different contractors, some of the different things. And you learn more about the Home Builders Association. So how's it been for you going virtually and just the audience that is, that is coming along with the virtual ride with you guys? It looks neat. Like, I almost want to be there with you guys when I see these videos. We'll have to take you out for one, actually. Yes. <laughs> I, will, I will mask up and go. It Can looks we get you fun. out of quarantine and take you with us? Is that allowed? <laughs> I, 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 I have plenty of masks. I can mask up gloves. I can put on the bubble that Jackie and I want to buy. And oh, my gosh. That's too funny. But it's got to be really cool, and it's different because it's, it's something unique that people get to still experience the showcase, and it's on, it's on Facebook. Yes. Yes, and it's it's fun for us because we get to go out and actually see the builder or the, the realtor that is presenting the home for us. Um, and again, it's nice to see people and uh, learn about their homes. And, you know, every year, I've been with the association now going on eight years, and every year we just have beautiful homes every single year. And so it's so exciting to go out. And it's so heartbreaking for all of us that we've had to postpone due to everything. But you guys are making it work, and of course, they can check you guys out on Facebook, and like you said, there's a new website. Uh, as far as the Home Builders Association, uh, what has been going on with you guys? Uh, what are some things that you guys got coming up, and uh, uh, how, are, how are things working out for you guys? Things are going good. Um, right now, we don't have much coming up. The Home and Garden Show is right now scheduled for August 22nd and 23rd, so we're hoping that we can still continue that. We're hoping we can get back out to Red Hawk for our Jackalope in September. And we are students return to school in October for our Build My Future. And then the showcase has gotten moved to the first two weekends in November. So right now we're just keeping our fingers crossed and we're ready to go. We're, we're prepared. We have everything ready to throw out to get these events going. And, and as far as home buying, I don't know if you guys have noticed, but the market's kind of thin. Home buying right now is still going very strong. Yeah. So they're, they're busy. Those essential workers out there are very busy right now. So as far as, you know, you know, one of the things I wanted to bring up to you today, Nicole, was uh, you mentioned uh, about your guys' interaction with the high schools and, you know, some of the programs that you had going on. And before we went into quarantine, tell us a little bit about what you guys were doing to get involved with the public schools and just this cool thing that you guys have going on that I thought was amazing. And I think we need to highlight that to let people know what you guys had going on uh, with our- Well, thank you for that. Yeah, so we were, we were working really closely with the LCPS administration and we were getting skill trades back into our high schools. We're about, I would say 75% complete with Onyate. We still have some stuff to finish out there. And next we were moving over to Mayfield um, to get committee's class um, even more um, some stuff out to him. He's, he's got a class that's going right now. We just wanted to add to what he was doing and then work on with Centennial and Las Cruces High 
Um, shout out to Carrie Hernandez and her crew. They are absolutely amazing. They're the ones that have helped us and have been our biggest cheerleaders. Jim Shapakan, the principal at Oñate, um, all, of, all of Oñate's crew to get that Oñate class going has been great. And the kids, oh my gosh, these high school students just absolutely loved having the hands-on experience of skill trades. And through this quarantine, I don't know if you noticed, but that was an essential worker. You know, those guys had to keep moving. They didn't get to stop. And so we're, we're hoping to get back on track and finish those, those programs in those schools. Well, if people want to learn more about what's going on with the Home Builders Association, or maybe they want to see what you guys have coming up, uh, anything that changes, because, you know, there's always changes uh, happening. It seems that every week we, we say one thing and next yeah. week, oh, it's a, a totally different ball. Yes. If they want to keep up with you, or if they even want to get in contact with the Home Builders Association, what can someone do if they want to get in contact with you? Right now, I would say our Facebook page is our most active and up to date. That's where our education classes, anything that we're doing, all of our um, showcase homes that we're visiting, the home and garden vendors, we're showcasing those on the home and garden Facebook page. Um, but they can always, always go to our website or contact us here at the office. Excellent. Well, Nicole, it's always a pleasure to talk to you and uh, especially yes. with all that you guys have going on. It's just great. And, you know, whenever we can finally, you know, all be in the studio together, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Uh, it's just uh, this has become the new normal doing Zoom meetings and inviting our pets. <laughs> And, uh, and everything else going on. Jackie's pet usually joins. I know, but I want to hug you both. I miss you I guys. Know. I want a big group hug. I do. <laughs> oh, I, miss I love them. you guys. I miss you. So we love soon. you. Too. Hopefully soon. Do you guys want to play a, a real quick game before we go? Okay. Okay. So oh, this was fun last time. I know, last time. So here's what we're going to do. So do you guys have happen to have water in front of you? Something I, I don't. Okay. I can get one, but I don't have anything. Okay. Well, let's see who's the first to three. Okay. I'm going to ask okay. you a question. And if you've done this during the quarantine, you'll put it up <laughs> one up. Okay. So ready? Okay. okay. Right. You've oh, had right. to fix an appliance or something that has malfunctioned over the last couple of days. Oh, my AC in my office just went out yesterday. He was here today to fix it. <laughs> okay. So, <laughs> yeah. So that's one for, for Nicole. Okay. You've made dinner and it turned out to be very bad. So you scrapped dinner and decided to get takeout. I've gotten takeout, but I haven't done anything bad just yet. <laughs> you didn't throw out dinner and just said, you know what? We're just going to order in. <laughs> No. Oh. I, I, I don't I don't like to cook much because I don't I'm not home much so takeouts pretty much our life at this point. Uh, I had a, a situation shout out to Wex. Um, I overshot breakfast and I thought okay I can do this 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 and this. Uh, I ended up burning in a bunch of scrambled eggs. Oh no! Yeah. Oh, no. So I was just like, can we just call Wex and uh, have them <laughs> see in this game, not us. <laughs> uh, you've taken a walk to relieve some stress during self-quarantine we take walks every night <laughs> all right okay final question and i know jackie's gonna be disgusted by this one. Uh oh <laughs> you've gone two days without showering oh no i will not <laughs> i'm not gonna lie i'm not gonna lie I'm with I have to my weekends but it was it happened quite a bit during self-quarantine Let's Unless I had a Zoom meeting, and then I had to, I had to get ready. So. I shower twice a day. I have a problem. <laughs> I waste water. I the longest. That's too I've, funny. The longest I've gone is three days without showering. No. Okay, that's a bit much. Nobody right. here. It's just me and the wife. Although the wife was kind of mad about that because she's. I'm just, like, yeah. uh, your poor wife. <laughs> she was like, we didn't buy onion. Nudging you at day two, honey. Yeah. honey you speak. <laughs> Don't look at my water bill. <laughs> well, Nicole, thank you so much for joining us. And once again, if they want to get in contact with the Home Builders Association, let them know how they can get in contact with you guys. Uh, visit our Facebook page, Las Cruces Home Builders Association, or call us here at the office at 526-6126 or stop by. Once we miss you, Nicole. Uh, I miss you guys, too. Thank oh. you so much, Nicole. <laughs> Once again, our friends from the Las Cruces Home Builders Association joining us on the show today, brought to you by Desert View Homes.